News on the pandemic here, and the FDA is now expected to approve a second booster shot now for people, Americans over 50. That approval could come as early as tomorrow. Here's Eva Pilgrim. The FDA expected to authorize a second booster shot for Americans over 50 as early as tomorrow. Those shots are likely to be offered, but not formally recommended, leaving it up to people to make their own decision with their doctors based on factors like health and age. It's important to have a conversation with your provider about your personal risk, your past medical history, to understand the benefit of an additional dose. And next Wednesday, the FDA will weigh a second booster shot for the rest of Americans, along with the need for a variant-specific booster. I would not be surprised, even though there's no guarantee, that we would require an intermittent boosting somewhat similar to what we see about the requirement of a flu shot each year. The push for a new round of boosters comes amid growing concern the Omicron subvariant could fuel a new surge in cases. BA2, now the dominant strain in New York City, is on track to become dominant in the U.S. Nearly 150 wastewater sites across the U.S. are reporting an increase in COVID positive samples of at least 100 percent or more. If things change and we do get a variant that does give us an uptick in cases and hospitalization, we should be prepared and flexible enough to pivot towards going back at least temporarily to a more rigid type of a restriction, such as requiring masks indoor. And the FDA could authorize that booster for people 50 and older as early as tomorrow. We could see shots going into arms within days after a sign off from the CDC. As for the rest of Americans, the FDA will kick off that discussion next Wednesday. David. All right, Eva Pilgrim with us tonight. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.